Elance is probably the leading outsourcing website on the internet and in this video I'm going to show you how you can post a job ad on Elance so that you can start outsourcing jobs that you don't know how to do or that you don't want to do. First thing to do is to sign up for an account with Elance, it's free. So come over here to where it says register and then if you want to hire someone or if you want to find work you select the appropriate radio buttons. I want to hire someone so keep that one selected and then click on continue or you can sign up using your Facebook account if you wish. Okay you need to fill in all the details here and it's all the basic details really uh, your name, copy name if you have one, country, your username and your password and then you agree to the terms of service and click on continue and there we go it says thanks for joining your account is being created and this just takes a few moments and then they send you an email which contains a validation link so let's just go to my inbox and you can see here is the email and now I have to click here to verify my email address and there we go I'm now registered with Elance now I want to post a job so I'm going to click here on the post a job button and there's a couple of ways that you can do this the first way is to simply name your job and describe it in these boxes here this is probably the most popular way of posting a job on Elance you're best to write it out ahead of time in your word processor like I've done here so this is the job that we're going to post, new WordPress theme needed, so I'm going to highlight all this one paragraph at a time and copy that so we can put that in and then here is my job that I want to have somebody do I can post that in and then I need to select the category of the work and you've got admin support, design and multimedia, engineering and manufacturing, finance and management, legal, sales and marketing, web and programming or writing and translation. This is for a WordPress theme designer so I'm going to select web and programming and then the skills that I'm going to require my contractor to have well obviously we we'll want them to know about WordPress so we can select that and we want them to know about PHP programming as well so we can put that in as well there we go then you can decide on what the work arrangement that you want, whether you want it to be an hourly rate or whether you want it to be a fixed price. Generally if you are going to have it as an ongoing job, if there's going to be lots of different things that you want this person to do over a period of time then having an hourly rate is probably the best way. If you are going to be just wanting the one job done or it's just one project or you want to hire people on a project by project basis then a fixed price is probably best. If you're not sure how to do it then the best thing to do is to have a look at some of the jobs that are already posted and you do that because you don't want to go away from this page. If you right click if you're using a PC up here on their logo and select open link in new tab that will take you to this page and then if you click on find work that will take you to the side of the site that job hunters look under 
and then you can select here under web and programming for example and you can scroll through and look at the jobs that are currently being advertised or you can search through it using the search function and this gives you an idea as to what the uh, current jobs are going for and that will give you an idea as to what you would want to charge so let's just go back to our create a job so let's say we want it as a fixed price and we'll say less than five hundred dollars there are some other options that you can select if I just do that you can see you can decide where the job location is going to be so if you want somebody to come to your office you would click on preferred location another box opens up here I'm actually going to keep it at no preference how long you want the job posted for the default is 15 days I'm going to leave that there start date it defaults to start immediately or you can set a date when you want the job to start you've got the job posting visibility it can be public which means it'll show up on the Elance community website or it can be private which means only people that you invite can tender for the job if you're in the US you can have them file the 1099 tax form for you I'm not in the US so I'm going to leave that box unchecked and if you decide you just want to leave these at the uh, standard default settings you can simply hide that again and then you will click on continue now before we navigate away from this page there's something else I'll show you because if you're not quite sure how you're going to phrase your job or what you're going to put in it what you can do if I delete that is use some of their job templates so for example we want a WordPress designer I can click here and WordPress theme project and then I can simply go through and briefly describe the business you can decide for example this is for a WordPress theme obviously each one of these is going to be slightly different but we can say whether we want this going to be a new website and it's going to be a blog to publish articles and we just want the one page and then it's going to be a home page and if there are any similar websites and then where it says any additional comments I'm just going to paste in um, the description that I had from earlier on do you need help with coding and installation? no it's just design only and then again we can select the skills obviously we need WordPress and we want PHP as well there we go and you can see it's still got it set at fixed price and less than five hundred dollars okay so we click on here on continue oh, briefly describe my business sorry I should have put that in there we go that's what I'm going to put in I'm an experienced internet affiliate marketer with several websites see it talks you through if you leave anything out they'll tell you okay and click on continue then you can decide which type of listing you want you can have it as featured you could have it as verified and that costs five dollars the featured thirty dollars or you could just have the basic listing which is free for this demonstration I'm just going to select the basic listing so click on select and there we go that's the job previewed 
this is what it will look like on the website and then you can make some changes if you wish and then click on here to post a job obviously this isn't a real job so I'm not actually going to post it but if I were I would click here on post this job and then it would appear on the website so there you go that's how you can sign up for Elance and post a job that you want to outsource.